Hello again YouTube, uh, I ain't gonna recap the last episode, um, sorry, as uh, there's not really much time before I need to uh, cover what's going on, so um, yeah, here we go. Ah, god, Shinra soldiers. It's a trap! Exactly my point, thank you for that, Ad Admiral Akbar. That's right, I have a special guest with me today. <laughs> it's got a Star Wars soundboard. <laughs> nah. Oh, sinister music. Who's that guy? The President of Shinra is coming out here to see us. Oh, nice. Shit, does this mean they've disarmed the bomb? I mean, they'd do that, wouldn't they? They'd disarm it. If, especially if they knew we were coming to, you know, come get them. I would have thought that would have been the first thing they did. <coughs> mm, sorry. Traitor? No. The name's Cloud. No, that's just that's just an excuse for being lazy. Don't don't question Sephiroth. Huh? And now he's pissed off, Barrett. Go on, put a bullet in his backside. King Vermin over there, getting uh, getting told there. Let's do this. Oh, oh right, okay. So, just thought you'd drop in and say hi before you try to kill us, no doubt. And then you go, oh, playmate. Oh, what's he planned? Where are the other Shinra guards gone? We could have just ran. Uh, and plus, what was stopping us from running the way that Tiff is looking now? Is he masturbating? That's disgusting. Put it away. Oh, what the fuck is that? Airbuster. <laughs> Myth busted. <laughs> we know what that is now. Okay. It's a giant, uh, giant robot. Is he really gonna escape? Yeah, you could have shot him by now. Alright. Fair enough, just let him get on board, watch him fly away, it's alright. Yeah, no kidding Barrett. Alright, that's enough chit chat, let's get into the fight shall we? Right, let's see what we can do about you. You're a robot, so bolt all. Although it's pointless having all. <laughs> okay, uh, ice. Magic seems to be doing good. Rear gun. Wow! <laughs> he must be called Airbuster because his backside's a gun. Fires concentrated rounds of gas. That's right. Barrett's gonna have pink eye in the morning because of this guy. What a dirty trick, Shinra. Ooh. Ooh, I'm gonna use limit on you in a minute. Another bolt. Hopefully that'll get him to turn round. Or is he gonna fart in their face again? Ooh, he's turned round. More damage for me. Antifa's in limit break. Is, have I gotten hers yet? Like, achievement-wise, I don't think I have, or have I? Damn, my memory is failing me. Oh, let's find out. Oh yeah, that's right, because I suck at the square minigame thing. You keep flicking the, the square button if you're on the PlayStation 1 version, or on a controller like I am. 
then uh, you can see the year, which is the criticals. So you can uh, hit the years a lot more often. Just a little tip that I seem cannot seem to get to work at all. So it's a pro tip given to you by a complete and utter failure. God, this thing's taking loads. Was that two limit breaks? And now that's the third limit break it's taken. You are such a limit break whore. Whoa, whoa, what's he doing? No. No, no. Okay, I thought he was going to explode there or something. Phew. Didn't want Cloud to miss out on the XP or AP. And a Titan Bangle. No, oh, okay. Fuck me. Did oh, shit. <laughs> Sorry, my language is appalling today. I do apologise. I will stick a warning at the start of the video. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, yeah. Instead of talking to Clad, you might want to try and grab onto something. Come on. You know that it's fair enough having this conversation now, but don't ask me questions. Help me the fuck up somehow. I know. Go get a ladder of some kind. Well, in fact, the ladder wouldn't really do much, but still! Go get, like, a mop or something I can grab onto and you can pull me up. No, no, it couldn't possibly be the end once you see what's down there, cl uh, Cloud. Oh, fuck, what's it? Oh, they didn't disarm the bomb. And... Skydive. That's not going to end well. I think we better count him out of the game. So yeah, that's uh, Cloud's death right there. Um, we should mourn him. Although somebody seems to be talking to someone. What's going on? Oh, Cloud! He's alive after that? Really? Okay, what? Is he talking to himself, or is somebody talking to him? What about now? I don't understand really what's going on here. Is this like Cloud's inner monologue, or is this somebody talking to him, or is it switching between the two? It's a little bit confusing. Oh, it moved. Right, so there's definitely somebody out there. And this has got to be his inner monologue. Oh, seemed to have woken up. I think. Oh. Okay. Is that the flower girl again. <laughs> well, she turns up in some awkward places. Well, I guess in all the right places and we're turning up in all the awkward uh, places. No, I am not okay. I just fell like 200 plus stories without a parachute. Sorry. <laughs> wasn't my intention to just drop in like that, you know. Kind of couldn't be helped after all of what's just occurred up there, so... Pretty sure she's stalking me. Yeah, I was going to say, the flowers are still intact, considering I just landed on them. It must be bloody resilient to also break his fall and still be alright.
That's nice. <laughs> oh, yeah, I mean, I was only talking to you like five seconds ago. <laughs> exactly, Cloud, face palm. Yeah, I remember you. You, <laughs> you were selling flowers. That's all right. As I said in the beginning episode, I'm a generous man. Uh, yeah, yes I do. Random question, wasn't it? Kind of like war then. She's got the war material. No. Mother's memento passed down. Well, we're talking now, aren't we? I mean... May as well find something to talk about. Okay. Um. I didn't realise like uh, checking flowers require uh, required like some sort of uh, PE style warm up. No, I want to know your name. <laughs> I didn't say anything. What did I mention? Ah. She's clocked on. Your name is... Ah, Ares. Okay, I'll leave that the same. And now, in the... Who's that? Is that just, like, strolling in casually? Oh, what exactly is funny about being a jack of all trades? I mean, seriously. Bloody helpful if you ever need something done. You always know that one guy, don't you? Or somebody always knows that one guy that can, you know, that you, need, you can call whenever there's a jam or a problem. He seems to know how to fix everything. Nope. I can't be a bodyguard. Or, well, in fact, I can, actually, because, uh, you know, I have a six-foot sword. So, uh, yeah, if I can lug that around and swing it and spin it, then uh, I'm pretty sure I can be a bodyguard. What? I bet it's going to agree with this automatically as well. I, I told you. Cloud's just like, right, whatever they say, I'll take. It's fine. I don't want money. I'll just take a casual date. Wait, what? What is the flash? Has Cloud lost his memory or something? That uniform. Yeah, yeah, you know, not like falling 300 f stories onto flowers is going to ruin them. You know, if that didn't ruin them, I doubt a little gunfire is going to do much. You know? Right, let's take this out back. That's right. Okay. Okay, it looks like she's going to be fighting with us.
They were Mako eyes. He's a bit depressed and he's staring at the floor continuously. Heh, <laughs> that's right, don't step on the flowers. They're, oh right, so they're casually ruined when he walks across them, but when I fall on them, it's fine. It's fine. Oh, let's see uh, how good Aerith is, or oh, Ares is in battle, sorry, I just used her proper name. Um. Notice how she's uh, a bit further back than Cloud. Um, this uh, being at the back row, I think half the damage you deal, and she just dealt 11, and half the damage you receive. So it's always quite a useful one uh, if you've got really weak characters such as Ares. Although it's not recommended to attack, it's probably better to give us some form of magic after this. Yeah, yeah, that's right. I'll give her magic and I'll let Cloud do all the damage. Be the like, black mage slash synergist for those of you that have played the newer Final Fantasies. Okay. I'm probably going to want to give her cure all, aren't I? Okay, she's got. Mm, but are all. Uh, what equipment have I got? I got that Titan Bangle. Yeah, she can have an Iron Bangle. All right, what am I gonna want? I love all and restore. No lightning. Stick with the bolt all, and now I'll give her restore and ice. Now I'll give Cloud the last one. Fire. Right. Hopefully I won't get into any more fights. There they are, over there. Uh oh. Do you mean that one? Well, I don't know, maybe jump across and escape. But no, let's stand here and have a casual chat about it and now wait for us to finish. They're polite people, these lot. I'll give them their credits, they are fairly polite. What do you mean? What? What, you want me to use magic or something? Ain't that an insult? Women don't like it when you make the. Uh, Comments about that age. So you get your back, well, your backside. It's how you get your face slapped in. What do you want me to do? Oh, is that a barrel? Oh man. Oh, I think we've just turned this into a, a Donkey Kong thing. Uh, which barrel? Let's play some Shinra bowling. Um, that one. Let's go with this one. Go on. Strike! That's one. I think there's a barrel up here for each of them. Yeah, it's gonna be a barrel of laughs. <laughs> it's another thing you should notice, I make very bad puns. So, uh, yeah. Get used to it. If you subscribe, this is what you're gonna have. Uh, you're gonna have to deal with this. Right, uh, a bolt wall, I think. Let's waste no time. Ares, Ares is in danger. Gotta throw more barrels on some people. Come on. There's danger, but I've still got time to swing my sword around. Okay. Do I do? Do I wait? Oh, no. Uh, hold on a minute. Which barrel? Which barrel? This one? Yeah! A strike two! God, I think Cloud spent a little too much time in the arcades, or rather, I have playing the old Donkey Kong games. But in reverse, jumping over the barrels. These guys clearly haven't a clue about that, do they? Let's just stand here and let the barrels twat us. 
Okay. Uh, uh, hold on a minute. I'm going to throw another barrel down. It's probably this one. Oh yeah! That's a turkey. I'm claiming that. I think that's like a a perfect game of Shinra Bowling right there. That should be an achievement. In fact, I am going to put something on here <laughs> on this video, an annotation that says achievement unlocked, because that really should have been one. Let's go this way. Uh, oh, that's how we get out of here. Is she going that way? <laughs> Ares, you're walking the wrong way. Phew. Okay, we got out of there. The place is certainly a lot bigger on the inside than it is on the outside, isn't it? They're the Turks. Nice. I would say their outfit was quite cool. Wait. Does this mean that she's that Ares is a potential candidate for soldier? Wow. Uh, I honestly didn't see that being a potential. Uh. Yeah, there must have been a reason. I just said what the reason was. Why am I questioning myself? Well, clearly she doesn't want to join Cloud. You know, she only hired us as a bodyguard so we could get away from those people. It's not very bright, is he? Really not very bright. Must be all the bad things that happened to him. Well, I thought you walked into me, that's why I started running off. <laughs> wow. Out of breath. Is she really a soldier candidate, or is there something on a larger scale that I'm missing here? Maybe she killed somebody from soldier, that's why they're after her. Who knows? Although that comment about ancient is uh, was just a little bit offensive, wasn't it? I mean, she looks about ten. And obviously, she's not ten. Probably about twenty, I think. It's pretty much the average age of everybody. Mid-twenties. God, uh, must have been about nine the first time I played this, nine years old. And now I'm 21. Jesus, it's 12 years. This game's making me feel old, but the nostalgia is too good. Still can't believe we got a strike at Shinra Bowling. I mean, that is awesome. Should have, it shouldn't have been a church, it should have been an abandoned AMF factory, that would have just been perfect. Okay, I can't quite see what's going on on my screen right now. For some reason it's not loading. Uh, what's going on? This is the third time it's done this. Alright, here we go, it's come back now, I'm in a fight. Sorry about that. These things remind me of the face, uh, face jumpers or face humpers or something like that from uh, uh, face huggers. That's it from Alien. Face humpers, pretty much the same thing. Right, I might move Ares into the front row. Should really use magic. Oh well, lesson learnt. I guess. 
140 gil. Might need more than that. So it depends how much they've got in the shop. Yeah, let's get her in the front row, shall we? Or the back row. Yeah, front row. Okay. Believe there is a save point coming up. Yes, there is. And on that bombshell and that strike, well, turkey, I should say, um, that is it uh, for this episode. Yeah. Internet's a little bit slow, so the saving process is a bit slower. Uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.